What's up guys, KGC here for another Valhalla video. This is the Soul Skin Shield. Okay, now this is what it looks like. Now, it won't be glowing like this when you first get it from Norvid's shop. It's 190 tokens from the festival, which you can easily earn by just doing the repeatable quest, uh, the repeatable task by beating people up in the arena for 75 tokens. It's really fast and easy, takes about four to five minutes each run, 75 tokens, you'll have them in no time. Okay, so back over here. So to Norvid's shop, it'll cost you 190 tokens, okay? Now, to get it glowing like this, all you do is go to Gunner's, uh, Gunner's Workshop and upgrade it to Mythical, and you'll need Tungsten for that. If you've just joined in the game, you haven't played the game before, you need Tungsten to upgrade it for Mythical, and Nickel to upgrade it from Superior to Flawless, okay? Most people know that, but you may not have. So, let's have a look at the stats. Now, the stats are a bit higher than they normally would have been because I've upgraded it a bit, but they are pretty good anyway. Okay, now... Oh, hang on. Why is it doing that? I have no idea why it's doing that. Okay, so it's in the bear tree, okay? The way of the bear tree. It's soul skin shield, okay? Uh, so it's half upgraded at the moment. But I'll just tell you what the main ability on it is. It's uh, gain additional adrenal adrenaline on critical hits. So every time you do a critical hit, if you've got, say, three or four or five adrenaline slots and you're quite high level, it will fill one of those slots every time you land a critical hit. So if you've got, like, a lot of runes equipped on your armor and your weapons, uh, increasing your chance of critical hits, then you have a massive, massive higher chance of uh, filling one of those adrenal slots, okay? So all three rune slots are uh, empty. And uh, yeah, I mean, at the moment on my shield, as it's half upgraded, for example, the attack is 90, block is 112, uh, crit pre is 60, speed is 23, stun 101, and weight is 19. So it's not a bad shield to use. Plus the fact that you get to walk around looking like this. I mean, it, it's not bad, is it, guys? Really, it does look pretty fantastic, even in the daytime. Let's see what it looks like at night. As it glows, I just thought I'd show you. This animation for the, uh, you know, for the transition never gets old. So that's what you're looking at at night. I mean, come on, guys. Isn't that just nice? It glows in all its glory. Just like the, um, I've done a video on it as well. It's uh, just like the, sh uh, not the shield, the sword. Where is it? I'll show you the sword that accompanies it. But you can't equip them both together, which is a shame. Here you go. It's the Blade of the Golden Rays. Now, I've completely upgraded this, but I have covered it in another video, so I won't go through it. It, 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 it kind of turns you into a Jedi. <laughs> that is fun, just phenomenal. It's mental. Okay, so there we go, guys. That was the uh, Soulskin Shield for you. I just thought I'd do a little video to showcase it for you, okay, and explain how to get it and what it costs and how to upgrade it for all the new players out there. So leave a like on the video, post a comment down below, and subscribe to the channel for more stuff such as this, videos such as this, or content such as this. But sometimes I say, I say stuff. See you later.